GBN, we keep you informed. I am Michelle Jones, and in the news, my sister, everybody made mistake, said the 16 shot by a cop, who requested that his family seek justice on his behalf. Please remember to subscribe, share, leave us a comment, and click the notification bell to receive our daily news items. As he lay on his deathbed, 18-year-old Tyrone T.J. McDonald expressed forgiveness to the policeman who shot him, but made one final request of his family to seek justice on his behalf as he maintained his innocence. Tyrone succumbed to injuries at the Spanish Town Hospital last Wednesday, two weeks and three days after he was shot in controversial circumstances by the police in an area known as Golf in Gregory Park, St. Catherine. MacDonald, a past student of Oscott High School in the parish, died leaving his mother, siblings and an unborn child. His sister Alia Dawkins regrets waking MacDonald that fateful Sunday morning when his friends came to the house and asked for him. Me get a call so my brother get shot. Me never really break down yet. But the next call me start ball. Me did a blame myself and me call him. Me and the police catch up on him said that wrong. Me can't bother up the police. She said tearfully. Dawkins said that the police failed to get immediate medical attention for her brother. An injured McDonald was seen in dialogue with the police before residents blasted the police team for not moving swiftly to take the injured teen to the hospital. On the day of the shooting, the police reported that the team was fired upon by two men while on patrol. They said the men ran onto premises and they gave chase and returned the fire, hitting one of the men. Them have him down there for a length of time. If the people him never come down upon them and see a little bit on a shoot, I saw them put him in the jeep. Them no recover a gun, so we are questioning it's a witch shootout, Dawkins said. She said that her brother went to a shop and was caught up in the shooting. Him said, my sister, I want to get justice to me. I want to defend me. He looked upon one of the police and said, I want to protect my mother and sister, please, she said. Separate probes have been launched by the Independent Commission of Investigations and the Inspectorate on Professional Standards Oversight Bureau into the incident. Dawkins said that McDonald received three shots in the region of his abdomen. He did not improve. He did not talk so well. Me turned to him and said, You still believe in the police then? And he said, My sister, everybody do make mistake. We go hundred man station and them tell we said them not have no charge upon him, she said, adding that MacDonald was under police guard. The teen's mother, Paula MacDonald, said that the family has been unable to get an update into the shooting, as whenever they have sought audience with the cop was at the helm of the operation, they are not accommodated. Until this moment no police no come and say anything to us, she lamented. It was everything to me. Me baby, my friend, me all, she said, while wearing two memorial buttons emblazoned with images of her son. The grieving mother said that the hospital had called to say that MacDonald pulled the tubes from his nose as he was allegedly being accused by the cops of firing at the police team. The whole time Tuesday the day before him dead, in tell we said him take him off of the drip, so him now get no fuel and him dehydrated and going to give up because him can't take it no more, she said, adding that her son said they connected the tubes because they knew she was coming. The family was in the process of applying for a transfer to another hospital when he died. They had also told his family that he wanted to see his pregnant girlfriend and would like her to do an ultrasound to determine the sex of their unborn child that was not to be. They were devastated when they got the call from the Spanish Town Hospital that he died. JBN, we keep you informed. Please remember to subscribe, share, leave us a comment and click the notification bell to receive our daily news items.